Hi gang, my name's Jim. I'm a solar boondocker. If you hang out with me long enough, I'll teach you how to be one too. Now I talk a lot about solar cooking and you've seen my solar box cookers. They're big. They take up a lot of room to store. They work fantastic, but they don't exactly fit in a van or a small trailer or, well, a lot of situations. So today I want to show you a cooker called the Quattro. Now this is a new cooker that's been sent to me to test out. Uh, the contact for this is Scott Rundle at gmail or Scott Rundle one at gmail.com. Um, if you mention Jim B, uh, he'll know that you're you're ordering it through me. And um, well, let, let's get on to showing you this. Now you saw how big the box cookers were in the rib video. This is slightly bigger than the an album cover. A little bit thicker too. Uh, it comes with these trivets or a trivet, uh, oven bags, and these are a set of stackable pans that can be used in it. I'll leave a link to Amazon for these so that you can order them or the various other ones I use. But let's get to the good part. Let's put this thing together. First thing we're going to have to do is fold it completely out, make sure it's all nice and flat. Make sure all these joints are nice and loose. By the way, this is $149 for this size. There's a smaller size called the Duo. It's getting windy, so this is going to be interesting. We're going to put this part up here. Put this bolt through it. Bring that down to here. This is the first time I've assembled it, so it's really tight. Really, really tight. Yeah. Bring that, that onto that side. Same to this side. And that gives us a basic box. a couple of clips, hold it in place.
balanced out. This is the general shape. Um, you, you can adjust it in and out depending on how high the sun is. You, you can bring this end down farther for lower sun. Trivet goes in here. These are two stacking pots got generously sent to me. I'll leave you a, an Amazon link to these. They'll sit in here. You wrap them in an oven bag and let the sun shine. The next thing we're going to do is cook something in it. I can't show you that putting it together in the sunshine because it would blind me, blind you, burn up my camera. But uh, it's very simple to set up and very small to store. That's the important thing is how small an area it takes to store. All right, so this is a pretty good size unit. Let's see if we can't figure out how to get it to look like it did when I opened it. That could be a challenge. Remove the clips. Remove the two bolts. This is life. There's ATVers out there. I, I can't control the whole campground. I try. I send Max out on excursions, but he, he's not big enough to run him off. I'm assuming after I assemble this thing and disassemble it a few times, it's, it's going to become a lot easier. Alright. Put the rubber bands back around it. And it becomes that size package again. Much easier to store than the box ovens, that's for sure. So, again, Contact on this is scottrundle1 at gmail.com. Mention Jim B. Uh, when you order it. Uh, thank you for visiting me at Solar Boondocker. Remember you can find me at jimindenver.com for design and consultation of solar. Please like my video, subscribe to the channel, and come back for more. I sure enjoy talking to you all. Thanks.